guys, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to show you what I am going to put in my kids' Easter basket. I don't normally purchase as big of items as I did this Easter, but we were kind of to the point where Hudson really needed a couple, like, some of this stuff, and I thought that Easter was a good opportunity for it because I needed it kind of sooner than later. And so we spent a little bit more money than I usually would. I would say I normally honestly try to keep Easter to probably about $30 max. Trampoline alone, I believe, was $40, so I definitely went over, but I did purchase most of this at the dollar store aside from that. So this is kind of his big item, and I do plan on having it built and ready on Easter for him, and I'm super excited, but um, maybe first we'll just talk about that then. So hiding behind this stuff, there is a three foot trampoline, and it has the handlebar. Um, we're just kind of to the point where Hudson needed a little bit more of indoor energy burning type of stuff. Um, our weather is still iffy here in Wyoming, even though it is April, and so I thought this would be really good, and it would be really good for times that I'm stuck inside cooking or cleaning or um, hopefully if I get a new job here soon, um, you know, working. He needs something that can wear him out and I thought this would be a perfect, perfect thing. Works good on his gross motor so we went with that. Um, this is actually from my mom to him from for Easter and it is a golf set. We are big into golfing in our family and so we thought it was time. He always uses our clubs and they are obviously not the right size for him. So we got him this um, golf set. This was only $8 at Walmart. Um, I really like that it has the like holes for the golf balls. I thought that was pretty cool. And they're actually larger golf balls. And I think that might help a little bit in learning like on hitting them. And I like that we're starting them off with the plastic clubs just because most of it will be indoors in the living room and we have a TV and we have pictures and all this stuff that metal clubs do not need thrown out by accident. All right, and then lastly is his basket. I'm gonna jump up a little bit closer to you guys for the basket because there are some little things in here. All right, the first thing I'm gonna show you is this egg. My mother actually pur purchased this for him as well for his Easter basket. And it's just off Amazon, I believe it was about $5. And it's, um, you put the egg in water and over a couple days it hatches and then there's a little animal inside. Pretty basic and I think it'll be really fun to do. I'm hoping he'll, he'll kind of get it, like get the steps of watching it and be patient, but we'll see. The rest of the stuff I actually did purchase on Amazon, or not Amazon, at the dollar store. Um, the basket is a basket we had from the years before. And same with the grass, but inside here I have a solid milk chocolate bunny. I thought that was kind of mandatory. And then I got him some Dory Bubbles, some Dory Gummy Fish Candies, and I actually got two of these. I have this one for his basket, but I also got a second one so I can put the gummies in his Easter eggs. And then I also have a Mickey wand that glows in the dark. I thought that was just kind of fun. And it gives a variety of character themes in here. And then I, um, this I forgot, this was not at Dollar Store, but this was at Walgreens and it was a dollar. And he saw this thing and he junk and loved it. I don't know why, but it lights up. It's a dollar and it's a little ring, easy peasy. And then I also threw in some sixlets in here that I got at the dollar store. There's a lot more than this, but I just saved some for me to eat because I love sixlets. So yeah, that is what is in my kid's Easter basket. Super simple. Um, because I spent so much money on the trampoline, I kept it pretty basic when it came to the basket. And in all honesty, he is only, he's almost two and he doesn't really know what the junk's going on yet. Just that that will be cool stuff. So. It works out either way so there we go um thank you guys so much for watching if you have any questions or any suggestions let me know below what you're gonna put in your kids easter basket and we will see you next week thanks for watching bye you guys